find the value of 412 plus minus 98 plus minus 84 plus minus 7 plus 35. Here we are adding a 5 integers. We can we have both positive and negative integer. So there are many ways to solve it. So uh, you can solve in any way, whichever is okay or best for you, go for that. One way of solving is you can pair the numbers like first two integers, then the third and fourth integer, and this will remain same. Like we can keep it aside and solve it later. Or you can group all the positive integers and negative integers separately and then you can solve it. Other way is you can go from left to right. You can solve first two integers. Whatever answer you got, you solve that with minus 84. Whatever answer you got, solve with minus 7. But that will increase number of steps. But you will get the same answer. What I will do here is I will start solving first two integers, then third and fourth integer and then the last integer will remain same like I'll, I'll write that in next step. Now that will reduce number of steps and it's easy to get the answer. So here we are adding positive and negative integer. One is positive, one is negative. When you are adding an integers of opposite sign like plus minus or minus plus, you will subtract the numbers and the sign of your answer will depend on number which is greater. So which number is greater, its sign you will get in your answer. So we will subtract these two numbers 412 from that we need to remove 98. We cannot subtract 8 from 2, we will borrow it from 1, 1 will become 0, this will become 12. 12 minus 8 is 4. Now we have to subtract 9 from 0 which is not possible. Therefore we will borrow it from 4, it will become 3 and 0 will become 10. 10 minus 9 is 1 and here we have 3, we get 314. We will add 314. Now we have to put the sign. Among these two numbers, 412 is greater than 98 and it is positive. Therefore, our answer will be positive. So you can put plus sign here or you can uh, avoid it. The number will be positive. Next, we have plus sign here. We will write that plus. Now we have minus 84 minus 7. Now you are adding our integers of same sign. Both are negative. So whenever you are adding an integers of same sign like minus minus or plus plus, we add the numbers and the sign will be same because both are either positive or both are either negative. So 84 plus 7, we have to add these numbers, 7 plus 4 is 11, 1 here and 1 will be carried, 1 plus 8 is 9, we get 91 and the sign will be same because both are negative, we get minus 91, then plus 35. Now we have a three integers. Again, you can take first two one and then third one, third integer you can keep it uh, in the, for the next step. Now we are adding a integers of opposite sign, which means we have to subtract. So we'll subtract these two numbers from 314. We have to remove 91. 4 minus 1 is 3. We, not, we cannot subtract 9 from 1. We'll borrow it from 3. 3 will become 2, 1 will become 11, 11 minus 9 is 2 and here we have 2. So we get 223 and the sign will be positive because 314 is greater than 91 and it is positive. And the next number here we have is 35. So we have to just add these two numbers now. So we will add 35 and 223. 3 plus 5 is 8. 2 plus 3 is 5 and here we have 2. We get 258 and it will be positive. So this is how we can solve the question whenever you have integers to be added, you can solve in this way. I hope this question is clear. If you have further question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.